All right, we have a 2008 Ford Mustang. Customer replaced the PCM and we already uh, had it flashed already with IDS. So we're using it with a D7 to program the key because this system, so we call PATS 3, where the mobilizer is stored into the powertrain control module or the computer, the engine computer. So we're going to use the D7 to program it. So for the special functions, for the key programming, agree Ford liability what we're gonna do is when I go to Ford if you can't find it type on top right little magnifying glass to find Ford there we go Ford USC turn this on all right so this one just like even though I'm key programming is for the uh, diagnostics. So we're going to scroll down and look for it. Type in Ford again. I'm going to go to key programming. That's where I made a mistake on. So ignition switch is on. Car doesn't start as you can see. Mobilizer light is blinking. So we're going to do. So we're going to go to North American Ford, Mobilizer, scroll down this alphabetical order to Mustang. There, 2005, 2009, this is 2008. Since past three, there's no parameter reset because Mobilizer is stored in the system. So usually this computer is refurbished. So usually already ha usually has two keys in the system ready. Brand new, you need to put two. So we're going to go add a key. Yes. This is one of open free mode. So most times with most equipment for diagnostics, use 10 minutes. Since mobilizer, we can bypass it. So click yes. Success. See if it takes it. Three. So remember this mobilizer light that was blinking here? It's like right over here. Pay attention to that. Turn off. See, it turned off. So now, battery's dead, but the car will start. So this is 2008 Mustang programming the key with a D7.